Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at the Draw Tight Chrome Trailer Hitch Lock and Coupler Lock Set for 2 inch hitches. This is a nice convenient lock set that will include locks for your trailer's trigger latch style coupler and your 2 inch trailer hitch receiver. The coupler lock right here, this will secure the trigger latch on your trailer's coupler to prevent theft. Basically the trailer can't be removed from your tow vehicle when the coupler is locked onto the hitch ball. And also would-be thieves can't secure your unhitched trailer to their tow vehicle with this lock installed on the coupler. Did want to demonstrate that. I happen to pull a trigger latch coupler. Just so you can see, there's the trigger latch you can see that you open it and then lock, lock it into place. And what you'll end up doing is you'll take your coupler lock here and we'll unlock it with the keys. So you can see with it unlocked, that allows you to swivel that. And what that does is there's your hole right here on the trigger latch. If you just slide that through there, slide this back, line it up, push it, and then push this. And when you push that in, that'll lock that just like that. And that keeps anybody from opening that trigger latch. So as we mentioned, if this was on a ball, you couldn't remove it from the ball. And if it wasn't on the ball, they couldn't open this up to try to take an unhitched trailer. And then to remove it, all you do is take your key, insert it in there, and you notice that pops out. Allows you to swivel that, and you can remove it just like that. <clears throat> now the flush style hitch lock right over here, this is used in place of a standard pin and clip to prevent theft of your ball mount or hitch mounted accessory. Basically you can secure your bike rack, your cargo carrier, hitch cover, or any other item to your trailer hitch using this lock. <clears throat> so what I want to do with that is again show you. For that demonstration I happen to have an example. You can see right here, you turn it to the side, and there you can see this is a two inch hitch has the pin and clip holding the ball mount in place. So what you'll want to do is go ahead and remove your clip, remove your pin, and to lock it, what you'll do again is take your key, go ahead and unlock that, and again that pops out, moves that outer portion, and you just slide this in place of the pin and clip, slide this back over, once it's over the ball bearings, you just lock it into place. And now just like that, nobody can remove your uh, ball mount. And again, to unlock it, just go ahead and put your key in there. Whoops. Once you get your key all the way in there, that'll pop out, and you can remove it just like that. So it's very quick and easy to lock either item, keep anybody from taking it. <clears throat> it does use a ball bearing locking system. If you notice right here, you can see the ball bearings on this. And basically, what that does is that'll slide right over those ball bearings and then when you push that, it locks it into place just like that. Provides maximum security and ease of use. As I showed you, just pop that deadbolt onto the end of the pin and the lock will automatically engage. They do recommend every once in a while to grease those ball bearings to ensure smooth operation. These are solid steel pins. They give you superior strength and durability. They are chrome plated to resist rust and corrosion. If you notice, they also include these plastic cover caps. That'll keep the key slots clean to prevent corrosion in your locking mechanism. You just push those in on all the way when you need to, and then you just pop them off to gain access to the lock. As you notice, it includes two high security square keys. A few specs on this. <coughs> we'll start with the coupler lock. The coupler lock, the application again is trigger style latch, uh, trigger latch style ball couplers. The inside, so if we lock this, the inside pin length, or the span in there, that is going to give you about three quarters of an inch span. The diameter of that pin is a quarter of an inch. Now on the hitch receiver lock again, the application, this is for two inch by two inch trailer hitch receivers. The inside span pin length on that, about two and a half inches. Pin diameter of five eighths of an inch. <coughs> But that should do it for the review on the draw tight chrome trailer hitch lock and coupler lock set for two inch hitches.